Yeah, hi, thanks for the case. Uh, we're looking at the TFCC injury question and this was an ultrogram. The first comment that I would make is, I, I find it slightly weird that the radiocarbal compartment was injected only. I would have preferred a first distal radio ulnar joint injection and see what we can see. But when we look at this here, we can see the surface is intact. There's nothing going down. So we don't have a communicating injury somewhere. And even at the periphery here, we can see the meniscus homolog outlined nicely and pristuloid recess here. And there's no contrast leaking into the attachments or somewhere. So we have to rely really on the PD fat set here more for this case. And when we look here, Again, we can confirm the disc is intact. We see the dorsal radio ulnar ligament here intact. We see the volar radio ulnar ligament intact here. And then the disc itself is fine as well. So the area where we see a little bit of fluid is here and we know there is no contrast in there. And this is the processus sluidius ulna. And because we have fluid here in a location where we wouldn't expect it to be, I would also give a high grade partial tear. I wouldn't call it a complete tear, otherwise I would have suspected the contrast to go in because it was quite overblown and there should have been enough pressure to go in here on the Arturo T1 fat set and it's not the case. So some of these fibers might still be intact or at least guard and, and uh, kind of like prevent the contrast from commun communicating. So I would say high grade partial tear, foveal attachment. And then I think you are correct that there is some interstitial tear component into the disc periphery here. And I think the foveal attachment is a bit hard to assess. I don't see fluid you know transacting it somewhere here um so that's why i would probably also go as you said con you know that it's intact uh, unfortunately we cannot really use this t1 here because it was very very much movement in here and the t1 is either like and this one is also not much better sorry for the phone because you know we don't have an injection into the distal joint which might have helped us in assessing this area here.